Welcome to another episode of One Earn and One Question of SLT Student. In today's video, we are going to dive into the mandatory professional examination called the MPE by the Nigerian Institute of Science Laboratory Technology. Whether you're a graduate of SLT or a student at 400 level, 500 level, HND1, HND2, this information is crucial to you. So let's get started. Now, no one disputes the importance of the MPA examination. It is a key step in professional development tailored to your specialization, that means to your option, to avoid misconceptions and job misappropriation and complexities. The MPE is open to all and only SLT graduates from accredited institutions and students at specific academic levels. So if you are in ND1, ND2, no, you cannot write it. Or you are in 100 level, 200 to 300 level, you cannot write this examination. It's only available to students in 400 level and 500 level and only to graduates of science, laboratory, technology from accredited institutions. Now, the MPE, that means the Mandatory Professional Examination, consists of two models each with two papers. You will need to pass all the papers in module one before moving on to module two. Failing gives you another chance to receipt for module one. The exams are conducted in specialized centers across the six geopolitical zones. And after passing, you will be inducted and given a license to practice. This license is renewed annually. So if you're a graduate interested in writing the MPE, you can fill out an expression form online and pay the necessary fees and proceed with, your, with uh, registration. Students in 400 level or HND1 will have to register through their schools with the HOD profiling the students for eligibility. So now let's talk about the cost of the examination. The exam price is actually at 95k, 95,000 naira for everything. Now, this, let me break down the cost. Now, to write module one, you need to pay the registration fee for 5,000 naira. <coughs> Excuse me. Registration fee for 5,000 naira. The verification fee for 10,000 naira. Then the examination exam fee for paper one. Which is 20,000 naira, paper 2, 20,000 naira. So, in totality, Modu 1 costs 55,000 naira. Now, to write Modu 2, Modu 2 would cost you 40,000 naira. That is, in totality, we have the total cost is around 95,000 95, naira if you want to register. Now, one, one of the biggest challenges that most students face is that most schools do not key into the examination early enough for their students to write it in HND1 or in 400 level. So most times they try to impose their students to write this examination, both mode 1 and mode 2 in their final year. And most times usually a financial constraint for the students. So some schools face challenges in registering on time, causing the students to register for both modules in the same year. My advice is for that most that students, especially the president of the students group, should key should advise their school to key into the program early to avoid the situation of too much cost implication. Now, this year's result is out, and let's talk about the October diet of the MPE. Modu one had over one thousand six hundred candidates, and the pass rate was over ninety eight percent. Meaning that this examination is not that complex, provided you have the curriculum and you are well well taught or you're well learned, yes, you're well learned in your specialization. Module 2 had around 1,000 candidates with a pass rate of about 99%. This is actually an impressive result. But however, this number is very little compared to the number of SLT graduates that come out every year or number of students in Nigerian universities and polytechnic. 
So I will encourage us as students in final level, five final level, and as graduates to please, please register and write this MPE so we can be professionals and be licensed. So there won't be any issues during posting that is for for during for students NYC posting, and there won't be any issues while looking for promotions or jobs. Now, so this is a wrap up on the MPE by NISLT. So if you have any questions or want more detail, please feel free to ask me in the comments below. Do not forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, writing on SLT. For more, con for more content and hit the notification bell to stay updated. Until next time, stay curious, keep learning. I will see you in the next video. Bye.